This European Cricket Network event is proudly brought to you by HCL Software, Paramatch and Local Lifestyle. And just looking at this lineup, it's a similar looking lineup to be honest. Arsenal's had a pretty good series. Also, I'm going to put it out there. Who's your MVP for this weekend? Omar Ali gets another chance for Spain. I think he'll open up in the second half of this game. But anyway, right here, it's time for the start of match five. He's going to start with a six. Maximo! Zayn Ali has been an absolute beast, and he's definitely in the MVP conversation. Starts with a little clip, and Atif just gets too close to those pads again. A little bit too short this time, and it's hooked away. That'll be four. Trazic bump. Bob well earlier. Uh, this is one that takes off a bit on Davidson Solaire. We're going to have the dreaded Minimo to start. Yeah, ledge. And unfortunately for Solaire, ends up with dust in his mouth again. Getting wrong footed to his left. And that's going to be four. Right, that's up. It's in the air. And it should be a simple catch. It is. And always Ahmed making his captaincy debut. Of the Spanish national side. He doesn't have the gloves on, but no trouble at all. Nakfi, again, a bit disappointed that he's not able to put on a big score here. Right at the end of the bat. Just need to get over the infield, but he couldn't quite manage. Up in the air, and this is catchable as well. He's got to make a lot of ground. He's going to take it. Omar Ali, fantastic outfield catch. Had to contend with a few things there. Kind of swirling, it was curving. But Zain Ali is the next to go. That's cracked away, and that's going to be six. Good shot. Really good shot from Sharif. This kind of holds his position a little bit better this time. Right up in the air. This is going to fly out of the ground. Maximo. Sharif, again, he kind of holds his position a little bit better this time, I think. Well. Look out from the trophy ceremony that we'll show at the end of this 10 overs. Great effort here. Uh, it's a bit of a wipeout job. Six runs. What a shot that is. Uh, well, never underestimate the good old fashioned hoik. This is going to be challenging and it's going to blast through Danny Long Martinez as well. Anyway, this is in the air. I think Harms is going to have to go for it himself, and he'll take it. Well, easy as you like, running back with the flight. And so that's going to be the end of Sharif. He does hit a few on the way to 28, but now he's got to go. And Amir Hamza, well, he must have done his homework with the wind because it was just drifting back to him slightly. Chopped away. Oh, Tortuga's got him, and that's probably going to roll to the boundary. It does. Oh, Muhammad Atif doesn't miss too many. Now thick edge, and that's going to run away for four as well. In the air, but that's going to travel out of the ground. Maximo straight over the camera one. First one, he goes for it and he gets it pretty good. Maximo Rabani takes it. Get him out there. All right, false shot this time. Catchable. Aways takes it, and they've caught pretty well, haven't they, Spain? As it'll be six and out for Simranjit Singh. And the captain makes it look easy. Italy will lose their fourth wicket now. 76 for four. Full toss, but this might work out. As Danny takes it, and once again, they catch well. They're going to check this one for height. It's close. My, my instinct is that it's not a no ball. But hey, what do I know? Picture tells a thousand words. I think that, to me, it looks okay. Bent leg coming down. I think it's probably out. But again, always, yeah, he's not giving us a good look at that at all. But it's given out. And uh, it's a nice little square drive. Digs it out of nowhere. There's Rajmani. Runs away for four. 
time he's on the walk. Kind of lose his shape. It could be another catch. Oh, he almost reaches it. Now it's as pretty as a picture up and out of the ground. Maximo. And this one certainly is probably the most convincing of the lot. Just giving a little bit of length to the left-hander. Ah, he's going to get a French cut for four. It's no justice, really. <laughs> and four runs. Now in the air, but I don't think this is carrying. But can anyone reach it? Oh, potential collision. And the fact that it's only a single probably is better than potential injury there. Hit pretty hard, but pretty good stop. Now, if it stops it going to the boundary, I don't know. It doesn't. Wow, good effort there from Reddy. That's a pretty good pull shot. He's going to crack it straight over long on his head. Maximo. Will someone hide Danny? I don't know where he's gone. But, uh, he's already taken one blow. Cracks it over the offside. Nobody back at deep point. That's going to go all the way. Maximo. This is pulled away. That's into another gap. And that's going to be four. A clever batting, really. That's a pretty good shot. That's into the gap as well. That's going to be four. Last ball of the ten. And he'll nick a four. So 130 it'll be. Mati Rahman is going to end up with a magical over in the last 20 come off it. But to be fair... It wasn't all his fault. Hey, look, 130. It's a really good test for Spain. Two weeks of pressure in Brescia, and it's Spain coming out, trying to get back to 3-2 in the series. 131 is the victory target. 92 to keep their point. I think they're really concerned about going after the win, though. And Hassan Ali, he's got, I've really been impressed with his bowling all the way through this series. He's going to come into Omar Ali. And Omar misses out. Now, Omar's a guy did see get on the park yesterday. It's his first time playing for Spain this weekend. To Baba Khan. And Baba absolutely bombs it. That's one of the biggest sixes we've seen. That's triple digits. Oh, boy. That would have reached the green on a par five. And Booney, well, it must be a blue moon because he gets one in the middle of the bat and it goes about 120 metres. Now he goes again. And he's that kind of confidence player, isn't he? Baba can't lift it up and over the top. Maximo. You ever seen a guy that size sing soprano? You might see it tonight. Now he gets another short boy. He's going to hook it away. Well, you hit me, I hit you. And poor Sharif. He's getting his steps in. He's going to have to do about another 200-metre chase. Slow ball. Chipped it. Oh, you wouldn't believe it. Twice in a day, Simajit Singh has taken a one-hand stunner. And it's a bit of a stinger as well, but shows it wasn't a fluke. We'll have to put those side by side because they're two very similar catches for Simajit Singh, one of the best fielders going around. Baba probably feels like he gets his over. And I've got to admit, I thought he had two, but that's the, the standard of fielding. He's just going to hit it straight. He's going to hit it over the top of the infield, and he's going to get four. That's a pretty good shot. And so Reddy has his first runs of the series and does it in style. Bowling to Omar Ali. Oh, yeah. Well, Omar, he's found his batting boots. Oh, and he flips this one out of the ground. Maximo. Now it goes over the top, finds the gap, though, and that's going to be four more. So Omar's catching up now. Now he's going to go, and Vimukti, well, he looks pretty nonplussed. Everyone's kind of giving him a fair bit of room, as they normally do when he takes a wicket, but this time he leaves the flips at home. Alex facing up now, and he's going to sky one. And Zainakvi should catch this pretty easily, and he will. And Vimukti is going to break through again. And well, Vimukti, you know what's coming when there's a wicket. He's like, yeah, this time I'm in. Bang. In the air and six. Well, ECN would probably have more hat-trick balls hit for six than any other competition in world cricket, and it's Maximo. Slow ball, picks it, hits it into the gap and four. That brings up the 50 as well for Spain. 
Pace is up now. And he's going to clunk one. That's a run away for four. Slow ball. Picks it. He gets enough. He does. Maximo. Always stepping up. Goes up and over the top. Maximo. Oh, always has come out and he's gone to 26 very, very quickly. Hit up in the air and that one's got a bit of legs. Corey's going back and he doesn't attempt it. Disappointing. Edged and I think that's gone for four. It has. Right up in the air, but I think this is holding up or is it? Back to the line and fantastic catch taken by Zayn Ali and he holds on to it. Fantastic bit of work. Ends up with a bit of a sandstorm, but Sharif again takes the pace off. Reddy takes it on and he would have got the distance as well, but Zayn guarding the boundary takes it, disappears in a puff of dust. Goes so close to stepping on the line, but doesn't. That loop. Now let's bit another slow ball and he picks it and he pumps it out of the ground. Maximo. Edge and four. A disgrace right now though. Harms is in big trouble. Suns are fact up, but that one's caught. They haven't dropped too many at all, have they? As Harms up. He's productive while he's there, but he goes six, four, and out. And that's why, because he's going to start with a six. Maximo. A little bit short. That one's going to be put away. And Maximo. So Shiraz watches, and the acting captain says, look, just do this. We go six over leg. Slow ball hit. But that's out. Gets enough. Gets out of the ground. Maximo. 46 now for always. I like the thinking there from Muhammad Arslan. And he'll do it. What a shot. Maximo. As always brings up his 50 in a lightning 11 balls. And we said, who's going to step up in this situation? It would help if someone could score a half century. Rajmani comes on. He gets cut away for four. Nicked and gone. So Iqbal is going to offer an edge. And oh, is this the beginning of a dramatic collapse? Surely not. But yeah, good ball from Rajmani. So Nakfi's actually kept pretty well. I do think he's kind of, he's a dabbler with the keeping. Yeah. That won't be a bang. And it won't be a run. It will be a run. And what a way to finish the weekend. Uh, credit to, to Spain. And particularly Always Ahmed. I think that was a really good knock. 56 in 15 balls. Actually slowed down towards the end. But they needed someone to stand up, and he did.